hi there, Team Ozone. Oh, wait, you're not Team Ozone. You're Planet Poke, because that's where I upload when I'm not uploading to my channel on a crazy 93 Wii, because that's totally not a shout-out to myself. Anyways, we trained last time. I don't well, actually remember. I mean, it's been such a long time. At least it feels that way, what with Pokemon uh, X and Y out. So I guess we're battling this dude. Or not. Let me check how many badges we got. All right, we got three badges, meaning... What? Why am I just barely in Goldenrod City? That don't make no sense to me. That's a rather odd con... Wait, do I have any? Should I heal my Pokemons? Let's just check right here. Uh, no. Mm, maybe. Uh, no. Apparently, I just healed last time, which I don't even know when that was. I mean... Can anybody remember anything that happened before Pokemon X and Y? It was like a giant flash and amazing things happened and nobody remembers what happened, so... That's a thing. Because it was just so good. It still is pretty good, I'm still playing it, so that's awesome. In fact, I'm playing it real time in my channel, so basically I'm doing awesome stuff off screen, like training and catching every single Pokemon I can, and doing the main plot stuff on screen, which is kind of nice, I guess. I'm not entirely sure how it is, because I like it. I'm not sure if it's likable, but uh, that's a thing. So then, let us go this vi Oh, well, that's a dead end. Who would have thought a dead end? Not in my house. This isn't even a house. So I guess last time we must have defeated Satan, the uh, demonic ruler of hell, and also the normal type gym leader in the Goldenrod City gym. So, that means we can probably advance on to the next area, which is Route 35? What, that don't make no change. Oh, well, I guess that's Route 35. Let's see, who do we lead off with? Tetsunokin, Damien, and Nefra, Bob the Builder, blah, blah, blah. I don't like my team right now, actually. I went to the gym? Me I just went to the gym, actually. Like, I, I literally just got out of the gym last time, and wow, I am over-leveled as hell. Um, who would have thunk it? But hey, it's a Nuzlocke, so I guess overleveled is the best leveled. I'm not entirely sure if it's true or not. I mean, I am pretty damn overleveled, but ah, uh, whatever. Uh, da, 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 do, do, do. Yeah, I can't avoid these. What the fudge? I just did avoid those trainers and then I ran into this guy. I've been getting Pokemon data off the radio. I think I'm good. Oh, hey, I think. Okay, never mind. I don't think you could sh How do you do that? I mean, if I could do that, we all know I would do that in an instant, so whatever. Diglett is ground type. I am poison type, meaning he's super effective against me, but seeing as I'll... I'm faster than him. I crapped on faster than... Wait, why don't I just evolve by now? Alright, I need a moonstone to evolve uh, Natalie, so that's a thing. Uh, I don't know where to get moonstone, actually. I'm trying to think. I say trying, because you guys know thinking is a very difficult thing, which I don't do on a very daily basis. On a very... Okay, how do I... Okay, I got this, I got this, I got this. Okay, one, two, three, four, yeah! Yes! Alright. One, two, yes! I'm a genius. I guess if you go that way, you could do stuff, but I'm not going to do stuff. Instead, I'm going to... Oh, what? Oh, yeah, they got a Pokemon Bug Catching Contest. National Park, but I'm not going to participate because I have to go to a gym. Also, if you listen very clear carefully, carefully, <laughs> carefully, you can listen to the uh, footprints. See? That's cool. Also, there might be an item over here for us to grab. I love the music here, by the way. Ooh, if you've got rock climb, you can climb up there and grab the item, which I probably don't have. God, I love the music here. It's so peaceful. Anyways, uh, we got the Sooth Bell, which is very soothing. Uh, no, it helps Pokemon who need friendship to evolve. Evolve. You just give it to them, walk a few steps. So I think it doubles. Like, normally when you walk 256 steps, your Pokemon gets, like, one point in friendship. I think this doubles it, so you would get two points in friendship. We all know what to do when the game glitches. I'm going to save and then restart the game. Why do I look like Groudon? Huh. That's actually pretty cool. I was like, wait a minute, that tree does not look right. That's not a tree, is that the game glitch? Save. Game, game, save. Good game. And now we restart the game so you can see the introduction video that starts at the beginning of the game, which 
Granted, I don't actually like it. I mean, I like it. It's just I don't like having to restart every time the game glitches. But at the same time, it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. Alrighty, there we go. And we do have to battle this trader here because there's no way to get past her. Watch. Told you so. And I'm gonna guess it's a psychic or ghost type gym leader just because of the appearance. That's stereotyping and probably racist in some place. But that's not here. Literally, uh, jokes aside, you never should judge a book by its cover. You could see a little girl, but she could be packing an MK-47 or... I don't even know. AK-47, that's what I meant. And she could probably blow off your head. So, yeah. Stereotyping is bad. Um, same time, though. In Pokemon, it's kind of obvious who's gonna have what kind of Pokemon. Example, Psychic Lady looks psychic. Maybe she'll have psychic type Pokemon. Who the fuck knows, really? I mean, bruh. But no, definitely, Psychic Type Lady's gonna have Psychic Type Pokemon. It just makes sense to me if you ask me. Kadabra is up next to the evolved form of Abra, another Psychic Type Pokemon. I could actually go for one of those right about now. I mean, it's a pretty cool Pokemon. I have not used it in such a long time. Last time I recall, I recall using it was all the way in Pokemon Emerald, which I never evolved it. So that sucks if you ask me. Yeah, we got 512 money, which is divided by 2 is. Ooh, tree! Yes, 512 divided by 2 equals tree. Mathematics with Ray Quasar 93 Wii. Yes. Oh, God. I must be making people dumb. All right, we can do this. One, two, yes. He doesn't move at all, does he? And this guy doesn't move. Let's just do the watery plant the tree. Yes, Squirtle Bottle, which you get after defeating Satan. I mean, Annabeth, whatever. Same thing, really. And seeing as how Sudowoodo is a rock type Pokemon and you just squirted it with water, rock types being super effectively weak to water, it's gonna get pissed off and attack you. Uh, that's not that big of a deal since we've got Double Kick, which is super effective against the little Wudo of the Sudo. Wudo, Sudo, Sudo, Wudo. And even though it was super effective, it doesn't actually do as much damage as I was thinking. It's gonna go for a fighting type attack and then it doesn't do that much damage because even though it's a critical hit, I'm very resistant to that type of attack and I'm trying to talk really fast because I don't know why. I don't know, I just, I, I got in the moment, I went with it, nyeh. I'm probably gonna level up after this, and eh, crap. Do I have poison point or sheer force? Uh, let's check right now. Poison point, meaning it's okay if I don't evolve for a little bit, cause I don't really need it. I'm mostly like a tankish kind of Pokemon right now. Seriously, Natalie is my favorite Pokemon on the team right now. I'm gonna be honest about that, yeah. Probably because Double Kick is awesome. Yeah, so if you look at her defense, wow, wow, wow. Not actually that tanky. Well, well, she's still blue and cool. That was fun. I want to give you this for entertain. I was not entertaining you. So the child gives us marrow. I mean, berry pot, which you can grow berries in. It's kind of like a really cool concept having a little pot thing in your backpack that you can grow berries in. It's like a fertile no, incubator for Pokemon eggs, but instead of you know. An incubator for Pokemon eggs because we don't use those. If you drop them, you drop them. Splat. Um, it's more like a berry incubator, which is really cool. Uh, not exactly the help most helpful thing because you can only plant like four or three, I think. But it is a pretty cool concept that makes you uh, kind of care about berries. And at the same time, you still get berries and don't have to really try that much. Ah, uh, crap. I think we should go the other way because the while it's full of wild type, wild type. Wild Pokemon, and it's probably gonna be really tricky. Uh, I should be able to get through here. One, two, three, yes. And little, oh, damn it, little Jimmy. Uh, oh, flipping wild type, wild type. God damn it. There's no wild type. I just keep calling it wild, po wild type Pokemon because I'm dumb. Alrighty, uh, let's see here. I'm gonna go for your headbutt, actually, because that's. Probably my strongest attack if you don't think. Actually, yeah, this is my strongest attack. It's Young Shmash. My name is Shadi. If you watch Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge, you understand what I'm talking about. Alright, let me think. Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, four! I didn't even run! How did you. Friggin' psychic people! Why are you so psychic and able to see what I'm doing and what I'm not doing? Uh, actually, yeah, if you can see all the possibilities of the future, you should probably be able to see. Every single parallel dimension and whatnot. So if I turn left or right, you're gonna see both those possibilities. If I go forward, back, you're gonna see all those possibilities. That's four possibilities you're gonna see. And then you have to differentiate between all four of those possibilities and figure out which one's the right one. So 
Uh, my nonsense aside, I didn't want to get capped or er, caught up in that battle. That yeah, was dumb. Let's get out of here without fighting a wild Pokemon. Yeah, yes, we did it. All right, crap, but I don't want to battle all these trainers. Oh well, you win some, you lose some. Oh, okay, so if the farthest of the twins saw me, then the closest of the twins saw me, damn it. Double battle, why? Seriously, I, I don't really want to battle too much. I mean, I understand that battling is very important in Pokemon and stuff like that, but I'm over leveled, and that's just gonna stay that way for like forever. And we both have fighting type attacks on our side, well, both my Pokemon have fighting type attacks, Meaning this I won't take too long since Clefable and Wigglytuff are both normal type Pokemon in this generation of Pokemon games Which is fourth generation by the way Because uh, sixth generation did just come out on October 12th, so it's been eight days Even though it feels a lot longer than eight days. Uh, it's only been eight days. Don't worry about it. So yeah And if you haven't gotten Pokemon X and Y, I suggest you do at some point before the end of next year, because it's a really good game. It just is. Uh, they just literally swapped which side their Pokemon are on, either that or they have doubles. I'm not sure. Mock Punch, super effective you. Uh, seeing as I'm literally twice her level, this will be an easy KO. Wow. 40 power, twice the level, I'm gonna assume it's 80 power times two, super effective, uh, 160 power. I forgot to calculate the stab, but that is about uh, 240 power in my head. It's probably not 240 power in my head. I mean, in real life. In real life, it's probably more like stab, 40, 60. Uh, stab is 50% boost, so why am I taking so long? It's 60 times 2, 120. That's still pretty darn decent, I guess. It's like a neutral headbutt. Kind of, it's close to a neutral head, but just 40% more, or 40 stronger, so 50% stronger. Numbers and things and places, nobody cares. We're here at Accuratec City. Basically, I can't pronounce this place because I suck at Pokemans. Now let's go inside of here. Ooh, what could be inside of here? I totally don't know that it's part of the game. What the hell is that? A Magmar? Ooh. Oh, I saw a Magmar. Now, if you look down there, there are the three legendary dogs, and if you look on to the side, there are the two legendary douche muffins? They're not legendary, but they're douche muffins. Ooh, it's, uh, Yusin. My name is Yusin. I'm on a trail of a Pokemon called Suicune, which is totally not in the basement, because I'm not blind. I can totally see it in the basement. And you are Ray. Glad to meet you. I heard rumors that Suicune is here. So I came to look. It's totally not in the basement because anybody with eyes could see that. But I'm not blind, so I can't see the wait, no, that contradicts itself. What are you blind? Take a look at the basement through the hole in the floor. There, sweet Kuhn is down. Oh crap, he can see it. Why is he upstairs then? I could go downstairs, but I know it. Oh wow, wow. This time, for once, the game answers all my questions. I know, I've tried many times. Uh okay, so you're just pretty much here to stalk or watch it. Cool. Ah, wow, Pokemans, who invited you? I mean, granted, this is your natural habitat, and you probably live here, and I'm the one invading, so I should be the one being asked who invited me, but I'm gonna just be the asshole and KO you in your natural habitat. It's basically somebody walking into your house, punching you in the face, knocking you out, stealing your stuff, and leaving. Possibly taking one of your family members for, like, an adventure and never returning them, ever. Because that's what happens when you capture a Pokemon. Yeah, realism. Everybody hates me now. All right, let's go over there and catch sweet caught, jump, jump, cut, 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 cut the scene. Oh wait, we don't have an editor. Sad face. And it's another coughing. Coughing has a very high uh, physical defense, not so much on the special spectrum, but doesn't really matter. It's got a high enough defense that it can take headbutt from a Pokemon that's nearly, actually, a little over twice its level. So yay, coughing being a very good tank for physical attacks. But it's got some terrible typing. Oh, not really. Anyways, my nuts have appeared in the tower. Huh. Oh, it's you. You must be here to catch the legendary Pokemon to make yourself look strong. Well, buddy, I'm not making myself look strong. I'm literally beating your ass on a regular occasion. Or regular basis. So I am pretty strong if you ask me. That is only a dream. You see, the legendary Pokemon suits a trainer like me who has sworn to become the strongest trainer. Uh, didn't youngster Joey say he would be the strongest trainer and he was like top percentage and didn't he say it before you so wouldn't the legendary Pokemon be suited for him now somebody could photoshop a picture of youngster Joey riding on that that'd be pretty awesome anyways battle time 
Yeah, in the... Well... I guess I like the music in this uh, rival battle, but it's not even that good. I, it, it's, it's really good. It's really good. But I've heard it a little too much. I've heard it a few too many times. I've heard it a few dozen too many times. So I'm a little used to it. Anyways, uh, what's his face sends out Ghastly, which is super weak to uh, dark type attacks. So it would be really nice if you had one of those. Like I did. That's awesome. Yes. I'm at level 30. Most Pokemon evolve from the range of 30 to 40. I mean, that's okay. Well, yeah, that's not entirely true, but. It's more like 30 to 50, but that's way too broad of 20 levels in terms of a spectrum, so that's kind of unfair, if you ask me. So I'd like, I'd rather say 30 to 40. But uh, I can't evolve without Moonstone, so yeah, I'm kind of screwed on that part. And we KO'd another Pokemon. There is literally no way I can faint now. Like, Even though he's got Crocodile, which would be super effective against me if I chose to evolve, it's still not enough. I mean... I got an 8-level advantage, and oh wow, that thing is tanky. What is wrong with this guy? Why are his Pokemon so freaking tanky? Why can't he take hits like this? And why don't I have a Poison-type attack? I mean, seriously, I'm a Poison-type Pokemon. I need poison jab. I, I get one thing with Stab that's very high in terms of power and doesn't have any recoil or anything dumb, or like I have to wait another turn to use it, like Gunk Shot. Actually, Gunk Shot doesn't have another turn to use it. It's basically like... Uh, Focus Blast, which is 120 power and 70 accuracy, but for poison type Pokemon, so I guess it's not that bad. At the same time, though, 30% of the time, you're gonna be missing, and I assume 100% of the time, you're gonna be needing that attack to hit all the time, so... Yay, losing 30% of the time. And with that, to the way, we battled his Zubat, which was his strongest Pokemon, and also his start, and not really. I don't get why he's got Zubat. Out of desperation, weak people sometimes do okay at fighting back I wow this guy is really conceited but we already know that since everybody and their mom has played Pokemon heart gold soul silver gold silver crystal and probably any other hacks of this game then again I highly doubt that the hacks uh, before fifth generation, four, fourth generation copied the text exact word for word but if they did, uh, that's cool, and mad props to them. But I really doubt the Game Boy ones, like Liquid Crystal or anything, copy the exact text that he's supposed to say. But if they did, again, props for them. Another thing that just came across my- whatever. Go away, nuts. I don't need you. At least not yet. I don't need you nuts yet. I'm, I'm a little girl right now, so. And now we go downstairs and do things and stuff, and there's a clown over there. I don't want to talk to him. He's a clown. He's creepy. Raikou, Entei, Suicune, Electricity, Fire, and Water, with ADHD. Sugar, Spice, and everything nice. These are the three ingredients Professor Utonium used to make the Power Puff Girls. But he accidentally put Chemical X in there and blah blah blah. We know the rest of the story, Power Puff Girls. Yes, Suicune likes me, blah, 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 my tummy hurts. I don't know why my tummy hurts. I guess I must have looked at uh, my nuts in the wrong way. You know, that can do that to you. Nuts is pretty damn ugly. Oh, well, everybody leaves after the legendary. So basically, they don't give a darn about... Then why are wonderful Pokemon here that keep interrupting you every five seconds? Nobody cares about these wild rat tat 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 rat tat which are probably, like, dying from, like, the burnt wound, burn wounds or something. I don't know. Speaking of which, was this tower burnt down recently, or why are Raikou, Entei, and Suicune just in the tower? Because last time I checked, they were revived in the basement. But then again, Yusin said he has been chasing Suicune for a long while, so I'm gonna guess that's not the case. Anyways, uh, next time on Pokemon Hot Gold Egglock Thing. That's the title. Of the if you look up right now at the video title, it says Egglock Thing. And if it doesn't, well, damn me, I'm wrong. Which is not that big of a deal. It happens on like a... Oh god, I thought the game froze. I was like, no! No! Game no freeze to one of you. But no, it's just a guy in a pink shirt. See you later. It's Bill, the guy who developed the Pokemon transfer system. So now he references Hoenn be because I don't know. Like, I like the references, but they reference Hoenn in a lot of Pokemon games. And they never delivered on those remakes, which I'm still waiting on. Which I guess if they had to remake Hoenn, they would have to remake Fire Red and Leaf Green at the same time, because both of those were last spotted on- Oh, then again, wait. Heart Gold and Soul Silver pretty much breaches the gap between Leaf Green and Fire Red, so... Never mind. I guess Hoenn's the only one left under the, the... 
Game Boy Advance who hasn't gotten the update. Anyways, that about wraps up, wraps up for today. Remember to hit the like button. Go check out my channel, Rayquaza93Wii. And uh, leave a comment, I guess. Because you guys apparently do that on this channel. Which is cool. But I don't know. Bye!